Yeah, I'm trying to get out of here. Little putz. Not you, hon. What you making? Turkey giblet casserole? Oh, my God. Jesus. That belongs in the lost and found. Uh, yeah, I was I was looking for the ID in there. You know, I just literally sent the report to your parole officer this morning. I said good things about you. You finish off your shift and you're done. Make sure you empty the trash. sit at home and listen to mom bitch about her stupid boyfriend what's his name again phil or see you whatever so how long has it been three months two weeks and 14 hours how do you the hell with it remember sophomore year we used to bet who could race around the pool the fastest oh come on come on maybe you could break another swimming record please or vice dinner yeah, I'm, uh, I'm at minus five in the bank, so you're getting dinner either way. <laughs> Deal. signs hanging up around here. Some people need to learn how to read. Some people need to learn how to kiss my ass. There's something I want to show you. Yeah? Thank you all for coming. Have a pleasant holiday weekend. The Katia Public Pool is now closed. What are you looking for? My ring, I had it right here. What ring? Just my ring. Well, I mean, are you sure you even brought it? Maybe you left it at home or something. No, I'm positive. I made you too. One minute. Hang on. I think I can see something down here. 
I know, so you're down by that black hole right there. How the hell did you see that? Wait, I mean, is that it? It's it. Thank you very much for coming.
the hole. It's thick. Need something to push through so we can widen it. Oh yeah, oh yeah, okay. Let's go and grab my tool belt. Get out of the way. Come on! Piece of shit! Come on! Ugh. Well productive. Why is there a hole anyway, people? Condensation hole or air duct? I don't know. Or maybe so people don't get stuck. Idiots. Like I said, we need something. Hey, I'm something. Hey, just keep looking. Think for a sec. What do you think the worst way to die would be? Quit being morbid. Starvation. Drowning. Stop. Sharks? Probably being eaten alive by sharks. I mean, that's all we're missing, right? David. What about him? He proposed. I was gonna tell you. He'll figure this out. He'll call the police when he notices I'm gone. It's been more than an hour, Bree. We just have to wait. Right. Okay, yeah, all right. I mean, let's just uh, kick back and relax and, uh, and wait for your knight in shining armor to ride in on his, on his white horse and rescue us. What is wrong with you? Nothing. Nothing at all. <laughs> this isn't my fault, you know. Right, because you're perfect. Going through all that all over again. Do you remember, you know, what the worst part was? I was coming home to find you not there. It sucked. I'm sorry. It's just I have my own life now. Can you take care of yourself? Apparently I can't. That's not what I meant. No? No, did you just mean to, to rub it in a bit? a little, you know, brag about your your giant diamond ring. <laughs> Tell me about how wonderful your life is with David. You've always been good like that. You did it, didn't you? You saw the ring in my bag and you threw it in the water. How could you, Jonah? Look at what you've done to us! Jesus! strong enough. And what, you think I am? If we try together or, or we take turns? <sighs> Sounds crazy. 
Look, if you're still scared of getting your hair stuck, then I'll... I'm not scared. Okay? It just sounds pointless. You have another idea? What's that? It came from outside the pool. By the bleachers. long before he starts to worry? No idea. Great. What just happened? I must be on a timer. Oh, shit. here, bring him, and they find out it's gonna be too late. Can we not argue about this for like the hundredth time? I never liked him. I don't understand why you would agree to marry that chump. You're so much better than him. Don't get started on David. It's so typical of you. You get in a hard spot and you start digging at everyone around you until you strike a nerve. I've had enough. Sugar's low. I'm diabetic. What? I need my shot. It's in my purse. You're making this up, right? Why would I? I don't know. Sympathy? That's a page out of your book. Not everybody thinks the way you do. Oh, come on. Don't fuck with me. That's not funny. I'm not. I was diagnosed three years ago. Jesus. Why, do you, why didn't you t tell me? Would it have mattered? I'm not a doctor, Bree. What does this mean? It means I need my shot soon. Or I could fall into a coma. shot. Okay.
Mark's never hurt. I don't feel anything, actually. It's like I'm dead. You never talked about it. What's to talk about? Are you serious? I didn't see it. Like you did. I only remember it after it was over. Don't. That smell. It's like it never went away. You know, I still smell it sometimes. Just stop. I wish I never looked in there. God, his skin was all black and flaking off like paper. Why are you still talking about this? Well, I had a counselor in rehab, Margaret. She said I should talk about this stuff. Is she your mother now? She's kind of a douche. She actually has terrible teeth, but she's right. You know what happened? Oh, I know what mom told me, and I pieced together the bits and pieces you told me over the years, but I don't know the whole story. Dad was a monster, plain and simple. He came in that night drunk. He could smell the coffin. Time to breathe. Filled the room with rotten stench of whiskey. a cigarette and just passed out. He was falling against the pillow because, because you could see the fire started right there. Right by his head. It's sort of fanning out like a circle. Spring. He didn't scream or anything. He was so damn drunk you didn't even notice he was burning to death. I pulled out I tried to wake him up. Here we are. It must have hurt so bad. Until after. When it was happening, it was, it was like ice sliding over my skin. Numbing me. It was like a release. <laughs> Never heard of two grown women getting themselves stuck in a pool before. I know, we're idiots, right? My daughter did something stupid like this once. She got her hand caught in the drain and I called a plumber for like a hundred bucks to come out and take the whole damn thing apart. Yeah. That wasn't even the stupidest thing she ever did. So can you get us out? Yeah. What's your name, honey? Bree. My sister's Jonah. Kind of new age names. Are you? Are you even from here? Uh. 
<laughs> what, what, what's with all the questions? You, are, you, are you gonna let us out or, or not? <laughs> Be polite. I have your phone and it's blinking. Looks like it needs a password. Uh, are you are you serious? Well, it might be important. Maybe somebody's looking for you or worried about you. Are you helping us? Yes, I'm helping you. That's why I need the password. Don't do it. She could call the police. I just want to get the hell out of here. Yeah, okay, fine. 7397. <laughs> uh, what, what's so funny? Wow, Bree, you're like a real cutie pie, huh? You and the guy with the wavy, gravy brown hair. There's a lot of missed calls and texts. I wonder who they're from. Miss, please, there's no reason to do this. There's a reason for everything. Yeah, hey, it's me again. Yeah, don't forget I have that dinner tonight, so uh, don't wait up. Talk to you when I get home, okay? Love you. Babe, where are you? Did your psycho sister kidnap you or something? Uh, call me. Love you. Wow, somebody's got drama. <laughs> Can you please just call him back? Quit being such a bitch! Why are you doing this? Come on! Wow, what a mouth on you. I wonder why David thinks you're a psycho. Let's see if your sister has any pictures of you. Oh, yeah. I bet that's you in the tattoo, isn't it? Bet that's not even something to look at. I'm gonna kick the living shit out of you! Come on! What are you doing? It's not funny! Simmer down. I don't think you're gonna be doing anything. Here's the thing. It's really tough in the real world, you know? And I just got out of lockup like nine months ago, and I, I can't get a real job. And and even the stupid crap job cut me back to part-time, and that's why I'm so behind on rent. <laughs> I, all the stupid bills, I... What does that mean? It means this is an opportunity. And if you see one and you don't take it, then you're stupid. So I'm going to need your pin code for your bank card, Marie. God, you crazy bitch. Yeah, an attitude like that is probably what got you here in the first place. Look, I'm sure we can figure this out. Just, just promise you'll let us out of here. No, nope. I'm not promising you nothing until you give me the code. Don't do it. Do it. Well, what's it going to be? Stubborn. Things never end well for stubborn girls. She go to hell i hope we have to cooperate no we don't have to do anything you act like we have a choice here she's blackmailing us do you have any other ideas we've waited out this long okay what's a few more hours jonah i don't think i can girls. I was a fashion snob too. Yeah, buying fancy outfits to relax at the pool. Just like you. What did you do? Nothing. I did nothing. But you know, I hope you know it does get real nippy here at night, you know? The whole like desert air, it's it's chilly. Like cut you right to the bone. Do you have any idea how much trouble you are in? I'm fine, actually. I I'm a little worried about you because you really seem like the string bikini. The heater should turn it off. This isn't a joke. You're going to kill us. Do you understand? Yeah, I never said it was. But unless you think you can get through the night without freezing, I suggest you hand over 
the pin code for your ATM. Just promise you let us out of here! I swear on my father's grave. God, she's lying! We don't have a choice. There's always a choice.
Kate's counselor in rehab. Did she ever talk about what happened? Stop. Then we're supposed to talk about these things. We're supposed to talk about it. Doesn't mean that I want to. <laughs> Only when it's convenient for you. Yeah, I'm sure. Whatever. Yeah, you do. in your account. A lot of good that's going to do me. God, are you joking? You swore to your father's grave. Listen, my sister's really not doing so well. She needs her shot. It's in her purse. She's diabetic. Do you understand? She could die. Yeah, right. If you wouldn't say anything to get out of there right now. I'm not lying, I'm serious. Come on, you don't want blood on your hands, do you? Oh, boo-hoo, shut up. I'm borderline diabetic, and my doctor says I don't even need anything. So maybe that's just for lazy people. I have a different kind. Can you just let us out, please? You know, I don't really see it, it just pisses me off. You know, you put me in this position because you are so stupid. This is not our fault. Don't give me that crap. What do you want? The world doesn't owe you any favors, and neither do I. Come on, this open is You know what? Come here. Come over here. Can you hear me? I might just leave you both in there to die. I 
was a good idea. Just trust me for once. You're right. You think this is funny? You got what you deserve. Now you're gonna let us out of here? You are messing with the wrong woman. And I'm sorry, Bree, but I'm sure this ain't the first time you're gonna get punished for something your sister did.
switch at any time, ladies. You understand? You hear me? Yes. Speak up. We understand. Can you please just let us out? I'm the one in control here now. We're sorry. And all these life lessons, they're not free. You have something I want. You already have everything. You, you have my phone, my purse. What else do you want? I want that ring. No, that's her engagement ring. She's getting married. Let me tell you something about marriage. It's overrated. It's overrated. You're gonna thank me in a couple of years. Trust me. I am, I am, honestly, I am begging you, please. Oh, you can't do that. Don't do it, Bree, please. Please, I'm begging you. I'm begging you, Bree. I just want to go home. Bree. pretty low but trust me it's always somebody lower than you can you let us out now i'll let you out when i'm good and ready i'm so sorry i don't want to talk That is not 
true. But I need you here, please. Oh, you know why you don't have to carry me anymore? You don't know we're sisters, we carry each other. Oh, God. You know, you just leave me here. No. You kill yourself, you kill both of us. And I'm not ready to die. And neither are you. I want to hear you say you're going to make it. Jonah, I want to hear you say it. Okay. I'm going to make it. Yeah, I'm going to make it. I'm sorry. I'm so sorry. It's not your fault. Oh, I'm so sorry for everything. you keep talking about no you're not we know that now really yeah we've had a lot of time to talk since we've been down here we get it now at first it seemed like an accident but we know it happened for a reason come on there's a lot of things we've done in our lives that were Right, Jonah? Right. Being down here has given us a lot of time to think. And when you let us out of here, we're going to change a lot of things. We promise. I'm really sorry for everything. You know, I used to be just like you. I used to have everything. And then you can all go away in like one second. So you better appreciate each other. We do. I'm gonna hit the code now. And when this cover opens, I'm not gonna be here. I don't wanna ever see you two around here again. Do you get that? Yeah, we understand. Okay, we just write this whole thing off to a lesson learned. That's all it was.
started. It all happened so fast. I just caught up and started burning. He tried to get up, but I held him down. I held him there until he stopped moving. Until I knew you wouldn't go into your room again. I killed the monster.
breathe for me, baby, please. Please. Come on, I need you to breathe now. Okay, come on. They were so close. Come on, we're out. Come on. Killed the monster. <laughs> 